United States accepted the Czech proposal for anti-chemical unit, uh, about uh, 400 of soldiers, accepted some proposal for big capacity flying in the system of AVEX, and there are open proposals as for the rangers, as for the field hospitals, and so on. Of course, those proposals from the small country cannot win the war against terrorism, but they are more than the simple expressions of solidarity. So, my position is very, very clear. I think that any enlargement is to strengthen the NATO, not to weaken the NATO. And that's why the single criteria might be the interoperability of armies. That's why the Czech army decided to transform itself from uh, the conscript army to professional army.